Recently, Alex posted a pixelated GIF of what looked to be either a new Kagane or a rework. And then within minutes, people were able to somehow unpixelate it. I have no idea how that works. So then he showed the actual GIF to everyone. And here's what that looks like. So, obviously, this thing looks freaking cool. And I didn't really know what it was at the time. Uh, at the time, it, I was, like, on my phone because I wasn't at my house. I, I was gone for the weekend. So when I saw that, like, I was basically on my way home. And then uh, later he was explaining how uh, he always thought Ken K1 or Kaneki's Centipede was kind of like Kura, where it has, like, the one mode and then it splits into two. So that, that's kind of what this is. And I think this is a really cool idea. So I guess removing Ken K2... And having this instead, which, like, honestly, uh, I don't care that's removing it, because who cares? They both suck, especially Ken K1. But this is, this actually, like, is an insane model. I love it. I love all, all the, uh, all the detail to, like, all the, the tentacles and whatever. That's freaking awesome. Now, there is a little bit more information. However, the credit to all this information goes to Null. This is his footage and all that. So go watch his video real quick. Then you can come back to mine and check out, uh, like, my opinion on this. I just really wanted to talk about it because it's freaking cool. So we get to see the R move, which allows you to move in any direction you want. Up, down, left, right. It's pretty crazy. And with that, you can do some pretty crazy, crazy dodging. And not to mention being able to move quite well when you're... A low level so say like you're getting attacked by you know like spawn kill or something you can actually escape you can go hide up on the buildings now obviously that's not going to protect you from everything however it is a quick escape from probably most weapons which is pretty cool and honestly i'm betting this is going to be pretty viable for pvp because of the multiple modes and from the one move we get to see some pretty insane movement and another small detail that i really like is when, when you're in the air and shoot R into the ground, it'll actually do a small smash, and I'm assuming that has a bigger hitbox and deals more damage. I love little details like that. And the animation as well in this thing is pretty crazy. I love it. That's pretty much all I have to say. Go watch Noel's video if you haven't. And the reason I haven't been uploading the past couple days, I'm pretty sure I mentioned this before, but I've been... I've been away from my computer for the weekend. Anyways, thank you all very much for watching. If you want to see more content, let me know in the comments and like the video. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.